guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a fall haul try on. I'm going to show you guys everything that I purchased first and then I'm going to try everything on for you. Every time I do a try on haul, a lot of you guys say you do like it better when I show you guys the items and then I show you how it looks on. So that is what I will be doing today. So I have a lot of items from Walmart. You guys know I love their new line, the Time and True brand. So I have a lot of things from that brand. And then I also have a few other things from I think TJ Maxx and Marshalls. And then I have one thing from Target. I also bought a few jewelry items. I'm just gonna start off with what I am wearing right now. This shirt is from Target. You guys know I love Hocus Pocus. That is one of my childhood favorite movies. And I found this shirt at Target. I believe it was $14.99. And it just says, but first Hocus Pocus. And it's like a very dark gray, kind of like a charcoal gray. And then in orange, it says, but first Hocus Pocus. And I got it in a large because I wanted it to be like a little bit low on the side. And I want it to be really loose. I really like it. So that is the first item that I have. I did wear this today and I wore just like a um, cardigan over it just because it was a little cool outside. But this is the first item. And then since I am also wearing this other item, I'm just going to show you guys right now, which are these gold earrings. I bought this from Walmart. It is their Time and True brand. And these were on clearance for only $2. So that is the second item I'm going to share with you guys. Everything else I did lay out on my bed. Let's see how this goes. I usually do like a sit down video and show you guys this is the first time I'm standing up and like have everything laid out on my bed. So I'm going to show you guys, I think, all the jewelry pieces and then I will move on to clothing. I'm going to start off the jewelry like I just told you guys. So other than the earrings I just showed you guys, this is the other jewelry item I bought is a necklace and it is the Time and True brand for only $2.88. It's a great deal. It's gold and then it has like these little um fake diamonds going down i love that it's very delicate and pretty so that is the first jewelry piece that i got i guess i'll show you all of the necklaces first um the next necklace i got is from the brand accessories and this was on clearance for two dollars it's another gold necklace and then it has like little flower um detailing right here it has like a bunch of jewels so that's the second necklace that I bought. Next necklace I bought is another gold one. I just realized they're all gold. I need to start buying silver. But the next necklace is this one. And it just has this cute little like crystal. And then it's gold and it's a long necklace. And this was also $2.88 from the Time and True brand. This next necklace actually came in a set, which I think was a great deal. It came with the earrings and a necklace. This was on clearance for $3.00. And the brand was accessories as well. Another gold necklace. And then it has kind of like that marble look to it. And then it came with the matching earrings right there. Super pretty. So this was on clearance for $3. And then I think this is the last necklace that I bought. Yes. So this is the last necklace that I bought. It's one of the chokers. And it's the accessories brand. This was on clearance for only $2. And I love that it came with two. So I can wear them together or I can just wear them separate. So I thought that was really pretty. Next, I'll show you guys the only bracelet I bought, which was this one on clearance for $3. The Time and True brand. It's just a gold bracelet I thought would look pretty to like go over watches or just wear alone. Now I'm going to show you guys all the earrings that I bought. The first pair is these green ones. I just thought these were so pretty. It has like a little tassel on the bottom and then it has like these like green jewels on top. So that is the first one. These were $4. The next pair were these for $2.88. I fell in love with these. I think these are so pretty. They're gold and have like all these cute little jewels in the bottom. The next pair of earrings I bought were these studs and they're gold with some more jewels. These were only $2.88. And then the last pair of earrings that I bought, these were on clearance for $1 and they were the accessories brand. And I just thought those were really pretty as well. So I decided to grab those. And that is everything as far as um, jewelry goes. So now I'm going to move on to clothing. I guess since I've already showed you guys a lot of Walmart items, I will show you guys the rest of the Walmart clothing that I bought. The first item I'm going to show you guys, I actually wore it today, so it doesn't have the tag on it, but I bought it in two different colors. And it is just this gray cardigan. And then it has 
pockets in the front super cute super comfortable i love it i actually want to go back and get it in black as well and then i bought another cardigan same exact one as the gray one except it is in white it's kind of like an off-white but again same exact thing but in the whites and then it has the pockets in the front as well and i'm for sure probably going to go back and get the black one as well just because they're so comfortable and they're so cheap they were only 13 96 so they have them in a ton of different colors so i got it in the off-white and then the gray next is going to be this i don't even know what this is called but this was on clearance you guys for four dollars so i decided to grab it it's kind of like a blushy like pink color and i figured i could wear this in the fall and in the summer so in the summer i can wear like a tank top underneath and then in the winter and fall i can wear like a long sleeve underneath so i thought that was really cute for four dollars Next is going to be two long sleeve shirts. So they're the same design, but just different colors. So the first one is just in white. And I like how it has like that little V in the front long sleeve. And these were only $7.44. I bought it in white. And then I bought another one, same exact one, but just in like the mustard yellow color. Because I think that's a great color for fall. So same thing, $7.44 for this shirt. And then I bought this shirt. It's kind of like a flannel. It's not um, like flannel, the material, but it's like the design flannel. They had these in a ton of different colors and I decided to go with this color because I feel like this just screamed fall. So it buttons up in the front and I just thought it was so pretty. And how much was this? This was $13.94. I got it in a large because I liked this shirt oversized so I can be able to like wrap around my waist or wear with leggings or just like tuck it in a little. So I got it in a large. And then the last two items that I bought from Walmart were two pairs of jeggings. I bought one in black and one in like a denim color. And it is these right here. It has like pockets in the back. When I try it on, you guys are gonna see, it looks exactly like jeans. You would never think I was wearing jeggings, but they're so comfortable and they're stretchy. These were only $12.86. So I bought one pair in black. And then I bought another pair and just like the denim color. So when I put them on, they pretty much look like jeans, but they're really not jeans. So they also have the pockets in the back like that. And these were also $12.86. So they had a ton of different colors. They had like green, they had like a burgundy color, a mustard yellow color. But I decided to just to go with the denim and the black color. So now I'm going to show you guys everything that I bought from TJ Maxx and Marshalls. It's all mixed up. I think most of this stuff is probably from TJ Maxx, but... The first thing is another cardigan sweater. This was $16.99 from Marshalls. And I just really liked the color. It's kind of like a like blushy, like mauve color. I don't really know how to explain it, but on camera it's coming off darker than what it really is. But it's super heavy, so I feel like it'll be really warm and then it has pockets in the front. So I bought that. And then the next item I bought was this like sweater shirt. And this was from TJ Maxx. It was $19.99. And I bought it in a size up because I can put it like off the shoulder. You'll see when I try it on, but I can put it off the shoulder or put it up. And it's so soft, you guys. I love it. And I also really like the detailing on the side right here where it ties. And I don't know if I just told you the price, but it's $19.99. The next thing I bought was this sweater shirt as well. And it's all gray. This was from TJ Maxx, $14.99. And I just loved the back as well because it has like that detailing where it ties like that. And you can either wear like a tank top underneath or not wear a tank top, but I just thought that was really cute. Next item I bought was from TJ Maxx. This was $6.99 and it's just like a basic long sleeve shirt. Well, I don't think this is a long sleeve. I think this is the quarter length. So it goes up to like my elbows and it has a pocket in the front. Next is going to be another just basic tee for $5.99. It's white, it's short sleeve. So you can always throw like a jacket or a sweater over it with some jeans and jewelry. So bought that. And then the last item I bought is actually from Ross. I believe, I think I kept the tag, but I'm tell you guys the price. It was $9.99 for this shirt. Um, I did cut it because I wanted to make it an off the shoulder shirt. But I love Selena and I saw this. I was like, I have to have it. They also had it, I think, in black, but I got the white one. So it just says Selena and it's long sleeve. 
And then, like I said, I did cut off the top so I can make it like an off the shoulder shirt. I thought this would look really cute with like leggings, jeans, black pants. So yeah, that is the last item I bought. Okay guys, so that is the last item that I purchased. So now I'm gonna try everything on so you can see how it looks on me. Okay guys, so this is the Selena top that I got from Ross for, I think I told you guys it was $9.99. Like I said, it was not an off the shoulder shirt. It was like, it was pretty high, it went up like that, but I decided to cut off the top to make it an off the shoulder shirt because I like it better like that. So. That is how the Selena shirt looks like. I love it. It's super comfortable. And I did get it in a size up like all my other shirts because since it is from Ross, I feel like it will shrink a little. So that is how the top looks like. And then I'm going to bring the camera down a little bit lower so you can see the pants because I'm wearing the pants from Walmart. And these are the pants from Walmart. These are like the jeggings. So super comfortable. It's just black. It has the pockets. In the back and they are real pockets super comfortable and i don't know i love them i did size up in them just in case they shrink i didn't want them to be tight on me so that is how the black pants look this is the top from tj maxx and it goes a little bit past my elbows so my elbows right here and it goes all the way up to here and that is how it looks it also has this cute little pocket in the front super comfortable and it has a v in the front it's a pretty good length i like my shirts to be a little long so i can tuck them in and tie them and then that is how it looks in the back so that is the shirt from tj Maxx. this shirt is from walmart it is one of the time and true brand shirts i told you guys this was 7 7.44 so this is like the mustard yellow color super pretty super in for fall it's a also a really good length i like the length and then it has the pretty detailing in the front right here and it's not too low where it's like revealing so i really like it super pretty i also want to show you guys really fast how like this flannel shirt looks when it's like tied around your waist i would wear it like this as well so i just have it paired with the black jeggings from walmart and the mustard yellow top and then i just tied around my waist the little flannel i think that looks super cute especially if you wear like some boots I think that would be a perfect fall outfit and I love it. Okay, so this is how the flannel looks when it's not tied around my waist and I love it. This is probably one of my favorite tops. I'm super tempted to go back to get another color. They have a bunch of other colors. I think I want to get the black and white one next, but it has a good length in the back so you can wear it with like leggings if you would like. And I just think it's so comfortable and it screams fall as well. I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to unbutton it and show you guys other ways that you can style it so you can unbutton it one time and then just tie it in the front like that and then you have like a little knot right there i think that is super cute to wear like that as well or you can just tuck it in so i'm going to tuck it in the front and i'm still pairing it with my black jeggings from walmart as well i'm not doing a perfect job right now but you can tuck it in like that in the front as well. I think that looks really cute. So this is the time and true flannel shirt from Walmart. And then this is one of the other shirts or sweater shirts that I got from TJ Maxx. This one was $14.99. It's really cute. It has the V in the front and you can wear a tank top underneath if you feel like it's going to go too low for you. But I try to pull it up a little like that. And then the back, that's how the back looks super pretty. And then I really like it because it's loose enough to just throw off the shoulder like that. And then that's how it looks off the shoulder. It also has the little slits on the side like that. So that is how this gray sweater shirt looks like. I love it. Super comfortable. And I think for $14.99, that's a pretty good deal. And this is the other shirt that I got from TJ Maxx. This one was $5.99. Just a simple, basic white t-shirt. And then it also has... The little pocket right here and it's a really soft material i really like it the only thing is i hope it doesn't get see-through i feel like it's a little bit see-through now so i don't know if i wash it so i'm get any more see-through hopefully not because i really like it super comfortable i'm gonna put the camera down so you guys can see i'm wearing the other jean color jeggings from walmart okay so these are the jeggings from walmart the time and true and you guys doesn't it look like i'm wearing jeans i feel like it looks like i'm wearing jeans especially 
since it has the pockets in the back like that. Super comfortable. I love these and I'm probably gonna go back for more of these as well and all the other colors. They have so many different colors. So I'll probably go back for like the army green ones maybe. I'm not 100% sure. They also had another denim wash color but it was just a little bit darker. So that's how the pants look. Now I just want to show you really fast how the gray cardigan looks like. I still have that white shirt on from TJ Maxx but this is the gray cardigan that I got from Walmart, the time and true one has the pockets on the side like that. Super comfortable, super soft, love it. I also got it in like that creamy off white color, but it's super comfortable guys, I love it. I'll show you guys really fast how this like little blush pink color throw over, I don't even know what it's called, it looks like. So as you guys can see, I paired it with one of the long sleeve shirts from Walmart. So you can definitely wear this for winter or for fall, just pair it with a long sleeve underneath. And then if you want to wear it for spring or summer, you can just wear a tank top underneath, but super comfortable, love it. And I wish they would have had my size in the other colors. I like that it has pockets on the side as well. I did see a black color, but all they had were like two X's and like extra large. They didn't have any other sizes or else I would have grabbed it, but that's how this one looks like. And this is the cardigan that I got from Marshalls. Also has the pockets on the side super comfortable and cozy this is probably the coziest one that i have so far i feel like but i just love it i love the color and i love the fit i love that it has the pockets on the side so that is the other one and it's pretty long in the back as well which i like because i can wear like leggings with it as well so this is the cardigan from marshall's i wasn't going to try this one off you guys because it's the same exact gray cardigan from walmart that i showed you except it's in like the off-white cream color but I don't know I decided to still show you guys same exact thing with the pockets on the side super comfortable love it I'm definitely going back for the black one because I just realized my only two black cardigans I have are super faded so that's how the off-white cream one looks like so this is the last sweater shirt I have to show you this one is from TJ Maxx this is the one that has the cute like little tie bow on the side super comfortable you can wear it up like that and it's a pretty de decent um, length in the back, but that's how it looks like that. Or I would probably wear off the shoulders just since you guys know I'm obsessed with off the shoulder shirts. So that's how it looks if you just throw it off your shoulder a little bit. It looks so cute. And I believe this one was $19.99 for this top. Okay guys, so that is going to end my fall try and haul today. I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. Please comment down below and let me know if you guys would like me to continue trying everything on for you guys. Do you guys prefer when I just show you the clothing items or do you like it when I also try them on and let you know and show you how they look on me? And also, do you guys like it better when I do a voiceover or when I actually talk to you guys when I'm trying everything on? This time around, I did talk to you guys while I was trying everything on instead of doing a voiceover. I've never done that before. So just let me know in the comments what you prefer and what you guys would like to see in my next clothing haul. And as always, if you have not already, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and have you join my YouTube family. Also, turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I do upload a new video. And as always, thank you so much for watching today's video and I will see you guys next time. Bye.